What's up? It's Game Freak, and I got a new video for you on Hood Outlaws and Legends. This is for John, and I call this build Vroom Vroom Build. Now let's get right to the perks. So in perk one, you're going to want Surging Smash. Surging Smash is basically the one shot for John. This is very helpful to sustain your time with the chest and try to keep the chest away from other enemies if you have to drop the chest. Now on perk 2 you're going to want cargo carrier. Now here's the point about this build if you really are looking for money this is not the build that you're going to want. What you're going to want is something else. I'll have another video out for John with that build but for this build specifically you're just trying to get that chest to the winch as fast as possible without the enemy team noticing. So you're going to want cargo carrier. It will spill the, the gold if you drop it. That is dropping it by being hit. Dropping it because you jumped off a ledge and it dropped the chest. Or dropping it just by dropping it to start a fight with somebody. But you will be able to bring that chest to the point as fast as possible. The next thing you're going to want... On perk 3 is Enraged Infusion. Now this is going to let your light attacks deal more damage. Again, this is sustaining in battle. So you're really going to want to engage in as much battle as you can uh, before carrying that chest. Because if you are trying to get the money to get more money, you're going to want to constantly fight and push those enemy teams away. But you do want the help of your teammates, so I would highly recommend to communicate with this build. So you have less of a chance of dropping that chest. Alright, let's get back to the gameplay. So on this clip you're going to see me running into two Robins and a Marianne who has the key. I end up engaging in this fight to try to get the key from the group. And you will notice that I do a one shot in the e AoE of John's attack will affect the other Robin and then I also hit him with one shot with my light attack which did help. Now this next clip you're gonna see the Robins again at the vault and I will end up engaging on the Robins with the one shot and I will also take the chest away from them and immediately start going to our spawn point to place the chest and in the meantime I do not get attacked at all by the enemy team they are actually spawned further away because we have captured all the spawn points but not only that with the build using cargo carrier it's going to allow me as John to move the chest in a location very fast. I'm already halfway there and usually a John would probably be just out that door from that one building I just came from. Now I'm getting shot at by a Robin on the enemy team which is why I'm swerving back and forth but I know my team is handling that Robin so I didn't have to worry about it and I had just to go and push the chest straight to town so as you notice I do get hit with this night. I try to engage with the knight, but one of my teammates, the Marianne, takes care of that. I go grab the chest and I start heading straight again back to town, which is our location for the chest. Now, as you can see, there was a state walking away from me. He did not notice me carrying the chest, and the Marianne also took that guard out, but there are more guards at the end of this journey and you'll see that they all spot me 
there's an archer up top that's taking aim, so I hide behind the tree, but a knight came up behind me, so I had to push forward. So then I started engaging, trying to take out the knights, but the knights took out me. Now, I actually was thinking about deleting this part right here, showing you the map and where I spawned, but I figured that it would be helpful to see the ending of this because what had just happened was our team had wiped out the other enemy team we had all of the points and I took the chest straight to town as fast as I could and it allowed us to have enough time to fully wench this and actually clutch that victory with the cargo carrier perk it is a very useful perk on John, and I would highly recommend if you are not going in it for the gold, you should put on Cargo Carrier. It will make games faster, and it will help you and your team get to the locations as fast as possible to the wench. Now I'll let you guys enjoy the last bit of this gameplay. If you do like this build, please leave a like, comment what your favorite part about this video was, and subscribe. It does help my channel. Thank you.